So welcome to this um, first squad builder I've done, and it's a very nice and very expensive squad builder. Um, most of this money has come through a bit of training on formation cards and through packs. I should have a pack opening around £25 pack opening somewhere in the next coming weeks. Hopefully, if I can upload it, you know, of course I will. So in net, we have 4-5-1. We have Wojciech Szczesny from Arsenal, from Poland. Absolutely insane keeper. He was last FIFA, and this year, even though he's now a non-shiny, he's even better than last year. Our next centre-back is actually our left centre-back. He's from France, and he does cost a bit of money, but it's um, Lauren Koscielny. Really great player. Um, a great defending and heading, but the reason I picked him, he's got really good passing as well as his pace. Real rock back in defence. The next centre-back we do have is from Brazil. It's Dede, overpowered as you can be. Great, great defender. Nobody nobody I've played has beaten him in the air. If he can get his head onto it and put it anywhere near the net, it will be going in, definitely. Great, great choice. He cost me 6700 Um Chesney cost me 1700 and Koscielny cost me 28750 So our next player here um, is Kieran Gibbs. I was going to get his informed, but unfortunately somehow it's gone up to 40,000 coins. I've got no idea. Someone could tell me why. There's something awesome about his new inform or something, or is it just some sort of thing like that. 6,000 coins. I'm not really sure if I overpaid for him. I bought him very late at night, but I'm really, really happy with him. He's a great, great defender. I think he has really good work rates because he never seems to get too far up the pitch. And as you can see there, we also did buy him for the 6,000 coins. Our right back here is a Brazilian Mario Fernandez, um, 1.2k, really, really good um, player from CSK Moscow. Um, four star week four that kind of intrigued me on his shot, but unfortunately his shot isn't really um, that good. So our next player is our right midfielder, and it is um, Ada Magidi, who else? Um, the inventor of the Magidi spin, before that be there was a Berber spin and the Ribery spin, but five star skills, four star weak foot, great little player. He's got two goals for me, he's well worth the 3.4k I paid for him. 91 pace, 86 dribbling, you can't do much better than that. Our next player over here is not a left mid, but a left wing. Our left wing here is Anino, used to be a, got, um, a silver in the last game, then got upgraded to a gold. He was a centre forward, now he's moved to a left wing. I do like him a bit more here. Um, he has lost a lot of pace though, that's quite kind of annoying. 4,000 coins, he does get full came in the left wing. So our next centre second mid is over here. He is a gold, and it's Busafwa. He's an absolute crazy, crazy player. If you if you can get any five star skills, four star weak foot, he scored more goals, I think, than my striker. Absolutely insane sort of player. Our next one is a little um, sort of a um, hidden gem I found. Amazing player, Leonardo from Gion FC, same as the Nino, but something about him. He's 77 pace, 71 shooting, 70 dribbling. Uh, sorry, 77 dribbling, 70 passing. And look at those, 4-star skills, 4-star weak foot, you know, absolutely insane player. More of a playmaker than a goal scorer, but as you see there, he has already scored two goals for me. Um, our striker here is, not a silver, <laughs> sorry about that, Samuel Leto, no one else but the pace, the pace person who he is. 4-star skills, 3-star weak foot, um, doesn't score that many goals for me, as you see there, it's only 5, same as Busafwa, but um, he's, I think... From last year, he's, he seems a lot quicker, a lot more clinical finisher, but I do feel that he is not as strong and not as good at heading as he was last year. That sort of did let me down, because I did really, really like him last year. And here it is, the big money spinner, by far the best t player on the game, uh, on the game, sorry, on my team. Inform Mark and Asensio. He cost me 62500 I've already had one, sold one on for 73000 You know, really, really good player. Um, he scored four goals for me, um, but he, he really does... Um, sort of do more assisting than he does scoring. Um, he's my spot kick taker, you know, for penalties and free kicks. Free kicks, I only had one free kick with him, and I got so close to the target. But I'm still working on this new um, dipping free kick. So our next player is um, Samuel Eto'o. Well, sorry, our next player, sorry. Our final player, who I think the best player in the team is, is definitely Marcos Asensio, um, by an absolute mile. Um, the worst player in the team, biggest letdown for me, um, personally, was probably Samuel Eto. Um He wasn't as good as I thought. Um, now looking back on it, I should have probably gone for someone. I'm not really sure who I'd have gone for. Um, maybe the Traore from Ivory Coast, but then I think I'd be letting down on pace. There's no other person I can really get him to link up with, unless I do get a lead on Gook. If you've never used him, he's an absolute animal. Well, he was in FIFA 12. So if you did le do this, please leave me a like, and please subscribe to my channel. It really does help me out. And um, thanks, and I hope you enjoy the goals.